Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 2. So today we are back with Luke, Simon, and Sarah. Sarah's actually at work today. And the last time we played with them, Simon aged up to an elder. He had our first, like, birthday, which is fun. And Luke is going to be aging up in three days, but we still have some time to have him become an overachiever, which is what Simon and Sarah both really want. Uh, it's both of a power one. They also want him to get an A-plus report card, which it's fine, but he, Luke is well on his way to becoming an, an overachiever because he, you know, top career performance. Uh, he has everything for next, his next promotion. He is uh, level two and the next promotion is level three. And he is an A-plus student, so... He gonna be become a he's gonna be a overachiever. Uh, with Sarah, she is like I said, she's currently at work. She has four days until she becomes an elder, and she needs level seven. Eight. She needs level eight cooking, and level seven logic for her next promotion. And I mean that, that she's making great money. One thousand simoleons, love that. Um, anyway, but I'm actually going to take the Sims shopping. Okay, turn the radio off, please. <laughs> please. <laughs> Just turn it off. It's, it's everywhere. The speakers won't shut up. What? There we go. Okay, perfect. Um, so we're actually, we're actually going to go, I was going to say downtown then. Not, okay, go transportation. There we go. It's actually, it's been a while since I've played The Sims 2. It's been about like, oh my god. And you clogged the toilet. Absolutely disgusting, Luke. Thanks for that. Thank you so much for clogging this toilet. <laughs> oh my god. Well, as I, like I was saying, it's been a, a couple days since I last played The Sims 2. I've been playing The Sims 4 a lot recently. You know, shocker. I don't tend to play The Sims 4. <laughs> at least anymore. Um, but I've I've been invested. I had to, like, kind of reinstall my whole game because, no joke, a mod actually broke the entirety of my game. Um, so I can't play with any of the save files I played with because they're all broken. <laughs> but I, I, I started a new save file. I started a new current household, and I've been playing them. Anyway, let's go down, uh, not downtown, into the... I mean, Pleasant, downtown Pleasant View, I guess. It's kind of like the shopping district of Pleasant View. We won't get downtown until we're on nightlife, which I'm really looking forward to nightlife. Oh, and Remington is here. I'm sorry about what's happened between you and Chloe. Like, <laughs> didn't even know anything was going on between you two. Uh, yes. So here's the taxi. Also, I do like how <laughs> pretty much every vehicle is just the taxi, but recolored. If that isn't, like, The Sims 4, then I don't know what is. But anyway, I'm, like, really excited to finally move on. Did I just say... Can Luke go down? Okay, no, I guess it's just Simon. Um, but I'm really excited for getting on to the expansions. Like, University is the first expansion in The Sims 2. And we'll be going on to that soon? I don't actually know. But... It's my one of my favorite expansions, and I really am just looking forward to playing it because I haven't actually played University in so long in The Sims 2. Uh, okay, so we want to go to 330 Main Street. Now, I still finish this lot over here, which is a senior center. And I mean, we went to the, the nightclub the uh, a couple parts ago with Chloe and Courtney, and it was tragic but it's fine we can revamp it when we get nightlife um but this is the boutique can i just say i love the sims 2 loading screens as well like just perfect oh my god bella <laughs> mortimer has seen bella her secret has been found out she never actually left pleasant view she just decided to move out <laughs> except she didn't change her name and appearance oh she's running she's fleeing the scene run bella Run. So anyway, you know, in The Sims 2, we can actually shop for clothes. You can kind of do that in The Sims 4, but I mean, it's kind of tragic. Anyway, I want to buy him some new outfits. Go buy everyday outfit. And, you know, we have changing booths and stuff. And these are like the nicer changing booths. And there are some 
like lower class, che cheaper. There are some cheaper changing booths that have cameras, and when you when your sim goes into them, like the camera points into a little hole in the ceiling. It's the Sims Two team, and like it does it when you're woohooing as well, because you can do public woohoo. Uh, oh my god. Oh, is Simon going to be one of these kind of elders? I don't know. Or should, it, oh, should he be like a politician technician? Or should he be like Pollination Technician 9 from Strange Town? Oh, I have too much power. Oh my god. <laughs> You'll be an emo, emo grandpa. <laughs> you got gangster granny and emo grandpa. Love that. I have never seen this outfit before. It could be Mortimer Garth. To be honest, I think that's kind of fine. Now, I do want to buy some uh, adult outfits just because Luke is going to be aging up soon and I don't want to come back to the shops <laughs> because it's like, it's a hassle because there's nothing else to do on this lot. So I'm going to buy something that Luke would wear. Okay. So there we go, We're just buying some outfits. And see, they actually go to the cash register and... You know, they pull out money, and let's take a closer look at the money. I'm pretty sure it has, like, the Beta Sims 2 logo on it. Oh, no, it doesn't. I swear it used to, unless it's underneath. Because it's printed both sides. And look, it's actually a physical object, and they pull out the money, and it flops about a little bit. Whereas in The Sims 4, they just pull out a tablet. <laughs> oh, you need to pee. Okay. At least there are toilets. Uh, go... See, we have urinals in this game. Sims 2 is just top tier. And this is all just base game. Yeah, Sims 2 base game is kind of weak compared to a lot of the others. Like, Sims 3 base game is a lot better than the Sims 2 base game, but Sims 2 will always be the best. It's scientifically proven by NASA that Sims 2 will clear your skin. Oh, that's... That's one of the sims I moved in, that's Mike. <laughs> Why is Bella just out here on the swings? <laughs> Bella... You're having a difficult life, aren't you, sweetie? Having to... Oh, no, don't... Don't go push, don't go push. Oh, there's... There's Chloe, though. Let's go say hi to Chloe, go talk, chat. We haven't seen Chloe since the last part, but... I mean, Simon hasn't seen Chloe in a while. Go say hi to your daughter. Oh, nice family, wholesome moment. He's talking about having five best friends. That's all his family. We truly love to see it. Do a hug and we can encourage. Don't argue, don't argue, don't argue. Like, maybe he's uh, wants to argue about, you know, encourage neatness, I guess. But he wants to argue about her not cooling. He's asking how, you know, her love life's going. Goose is like, I want more grandkids. See, like, he does. He wants to have a grandchild. <laughs> I've never actually read this description before. For some Sims, the elder years are made sweet by the little grandchildren. To get a grandchild for your Sim, have one of your Sims' children try for a baby or adopt a Sim. Look in the relationships panel to see which Sims are your Sims' children. I mean, we know. Why is he going away? Oh, there we go. We're having a little hug just outside the boutique. Of course Chloe would be here though. Of course she would be at the boutique. Because she's like one of the most fashion forward sims. Oh my god, Mortimer. Mortimer, you can't cough in public. There's a pandemic going on. Jesus Christ, none of these sims are wearing masks. They're not, they're not social distancing. How are they? Uh, and he's there uh, encouraging neatness. Okay, we're going to go home now. We bought our outfit. Let's go home. Maybe he was just telling Chloe about buying a new outfit. <laughs> oh my god, don't... I thought they were, like, making out or something. Oh, she's just having a go at Martha. How rude. Okay, let's just call the taxi and go home. Oh. Oh, there's Mary Sue. Let's talk to Mary Sue, actually. I bet, like, they'd be friends. Okay, but the taxi's here. Okay, let's go home. Okay. And of course, it's the exact same time we left. <laughs> oh well. Okay. 
Simon is now home, so let's go try on some new outfits. <laughs> Plan outfit every day. Are you okay? Simon, please stop. Uh, yeah, that's fine. So here's... Did he just... Ch change into every day? He didn't... Simon. Ex si okay. okay. <laughs> we are experiencing glitches. Plan up every day. Okay, he's just not going to change his out. Fine. We just wasted money for no reason. I just told him to take a bath. <laughs> I had to tell him to go take a pee. Okay, that's fine. Anyway, can we... When when does Sarah come home? Three o'clock. Okay. Oh, there's Remington. You know what? Let's invite his boyfriend over. Cool, Sam. We haven't, we've only seen him once. Oh, God. Which one was it? Was it Randy or Orlando? I think it was Orlando, right? Invite over. Yeah, Orlando. Okay, let's add those screenshots. Oh no! We can't add the screenshots we took. God damn it. Alright, never mind. It's always a pleasure to see you. I'll be right over. I know Luke has a day off today. Okay. Please go pee. Thank you. Uh, can we... Don't play the piano, please. Uh, let's go... S Resume. There is a phone call. And you're still on the toilet. Sir. Okay, can you go answer the phone? Oh, and... Orlando is here. Oh. Hello. Oh. Okay. Go greet Orlando. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's wearing... Oh, no. He's wearing socks and sandals. Please. Okay, oh god. He's cooking on the stove. We all know how that's meant before. Okay. Okay, Simon, go greet Orlando. Go greet Orlando. Don't... Don't do that. Okay, go greet Orlando. Have him come inside. Uh -huh. <laughs> Just... Shake your head. Oh my god. Please. Simon. Are you good? I think he has the flu. Like, my dude. You're right. Oh my god, he only made a grilled cheese sandwich for himself. How, how dare he? Where is he going? Oh, he's going straight to the hot tub, isn't he? Okay, go join your boyfriend in the hot tub. You know, we can't... Teens can't woohoo in The Sims 4, in The Sims 2, so it's fine. It's not like they're going to be partaking in any suspicious activities. They're just going to splash. It's all, it's, all, it's all PG-13, don't worry. I mean, they can cuddle, though. I guess we can do that. My, my man. Okay. Remington, please. Stop. Let me move that. Remington, please. It's just... <laughs> he's been trying to... Do... Oh, my God. Oh, that's that's wholesome. We love to see it. The gays are thriving. But Remington, please. It's right there. You can get Remington. Okay, Scott, I guess you're going to have to clean that up. Oh, and Sarah's home. Please pay the bills. <laughs> we don't need the Repo Man coming. That almost happened the other day. <laughs> oh, he he hello? 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 Sir? Who the hell are you? <laughs> Excuse me? I don't know who this man is. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> d d d d are you like Orlando's...
brother or something? See, now that now it's awkward. Carson, I don't know who you are. Carson Walker. Sir. Oh, now Orlando's leaving. Sir, please. Please leave. I don't know who you are. I am... Unless... Oh, maybe Sarah brought him home as a friend or something. But then again, he's not in his work attire. Can you answer the phone, please? Sarah, go answer the phone. Thank you. Why are you... Orlando, why are you just staring at us, please? Orlando. <laughs> he's just staring like, right at me. I'm scared for my life. I feel like I'm going to get murdered by these sims. Oh, there we go. What's, what's all... I'll play Red Hands. Hey, Sarah, is Luke available to talk? No, I'm hanging with my boyfriend. Please leave me alone. Uh, propose. Go steady. Oh, wait, we can go steady. I didn't realize we hadn't done this before. Oh, that's cute. Aw, oh, I forgot teens could do that. Like, teens in The Sims 2 are honestly, I think, one of my favorites. No, oh my god, I forgot how popular Luke is. Oh, now he loves... Can we do a smooch? Oh, no. <laughs> Trouble in paradise. Oh, no. no. I mean... Okay. Romantic hug instead. There we go. But like, I still don't know who this random man is. Please leave. Don't join. Just ask him to leave. Just shoo. Ask him to leave. Say goodbye to Carson. Bye, random man. Thanks for stopping by. Oh my god, who is answering? Who, who is calling us now? Please. If it's like Angela or Lilith or someone, I'm going to beat them up. No, I don't know who you are, random woman. Please leave us alone. Okay. Sarah. Oh, okay. We love family bathroom time. Hello. We, we truly love family bathroom time. Okay, then. God, by the end of this series, these family trees, like, for any family I play in the future, are gonna be so long. I take photos of the like, like, most random crap. You can't go into the bathroom. I need to invest in a second bathroom for this house. Like, seriously. I need a new bath. We need a new bathroom. <laughs> Like, somewhere, just put another bathroom. I don't know where there's space, but I need to. It needs to be done. Maybe by the next time we play with this household, then I'll remodel it a little. I don't know. Okay, there's only two more days before Luke's birthday with an aspiration as full as his. There's not much to worry about. Just make sure to avoid any fears so that Luke can carry that aspiration meter to the next phase of life. Okay, we're going to say goodbye to Orlando. Propose sleepover. Say goodbye. Just say goodbye. Just say goodbye. Just say goodbye. Just tell him bye. Just say goodbye. Just say goodbye. Just say goodbye. We'll see him later. We're going to sneak out. Or maybe we'll ask for permission to go out. Oh, hi, Cassandra. What's that, beach? Oh my god, I just realized Simon's already in bed. That's what happens when you're an elder. Uh, but we're going to ask for permission to go out. And then if we can't have permission, then I guess we'll sneak out. But this is another fun thing you can do with the teens. Oh, sh sweet. She gave us permission. Okay. Uh, cool. 
go out. And then, who should we go out with? You know, I guess we could go out with Orlando. I kind of want to go out with Lilith. I feel like she'd be fun to sneak out with. And they're like, he's, he's really good friends with Lilith. Uh, gee, I never thought you'd ask. I'll be right over. So, he's about to go out. Please, let me bring the dresser down. So you can ch just change down here. I need to build like a pool house or something as well. Like over here or something. There we go. <clears throat> Take it back upstairs. Oh, there we go. There's Lilith. Hey, queen. Go out with Lilith. You know, the bad girl, the rebel of the neighborhood. I believe like she'd be fun to sneak out with. Lilith is one of my favorite sims. You know, just a last night of fun before he ages up to an adult. <clears throat> Why is Sarah playing on the computer in his room? Please stop that. Please don't. Be much appreciated. Now we'll just go to bed. <laughs> Everyone always appreciates an early night. I know I do. I love going to bed and then just sitting and watching Netflix, like laying in bed, watching Netflix for a couple hours, but like fully in bed at like eight o'clock. It's, I love it. It's, it's great. <clears throat> okay. So everyone is awake. Uh, Simon, Sarah's carpool is coming in an hour, but I'm actually going to have her take a vacation day, uh, just so she can work on her skills cool work. I believe she has a vacation day available. Oh, she doesn't. Oh, no. Oh, well. <laughs> We're gonna call in sick anyway. Call in sick. Because <laughs> I just wanted to work on her skills to get a promotion. Oh, there's her couple. Um... Let's see. Wow, you sure don't sound healthy. Did you need to take a day off? Yes. Uh, it sounds like you're in pretty bad shape. Take the day off and just... Uh, take the day off and you can keep your vacation time. Just get better. Okay. So now we're going to study cooking. Because she needs to get to level 8. I'm not in the mood right now. Excuse me, bitch. Oh, you need... Okay, go serve. Okay, Simon, get out the way. Serve breakfast. Serve some omelettes. Okay, no, you're not gonna... You're gonna sit here and wait. Because he's making you some omelettes. And the carpool, you can you can leave. <laughs> you, you, can, you can leave. What's your name? Robin, you can leave. She's making drinks. She is an alcoholic. <laughs> Are you okay, Sarah? Hurry up with those omelets, please. Oh, and our gardener is here. Hello, please. Can you take care of the weed situation? Uh, we quite, we kind of have a few. Oh my god, it's Ricky! Tricky Ricky! <laughs> oh my god, I've seen so many people have so many problems with Ricky. Did he just pee himself? I think he just peed himself. Like... Excuse me, sir. I know you're the maid and all, but please, don't pee yourself. It's fine. The toilet was right there. Oh, and I believe... Whose carpool is this? Is this Luke's? Oh yeah, so Luke is off to work now. And hopefully, he should be getting his promotion. There Luke goes. He should be... Getting his promotion, and then he can become an overachiever, and everyone will be happy at the end. <laughs> we'll explore that when it's actually seasons. Okay, so Luke will grow up in just one day at 7pm. It's time to plan a party. Oh my god! <gasps> It's all happened. It's all happened. <clears throat> okay. So, he's now the top of the athletic career track for teens. He's been promoted to team mascot. Athletes, young and old, have to start somewhere, even if it's sweating inside a cartoon animal suit. A very physical grunt job, but it pays better than the locker room, and at least you can watch the game from up close. Now, instead of the water and towels, the coach expects you to pre prepare the players snacks. A lot of snacks. 
Luke now works from three to six, starting immediately. Luke brought home 120 civilians and with a bonus of 250. Okay, so the garden just left. Sarah has only two days. Okay, so Luke just became an overachiever, <clears throat> which is here, was an overachiever. There's nothing I can't do if I put my mind to it. Greatness, here I come. And reach the top of the athletic career. And then they've just seen Luke was an overachiever. Now that's what I call effort. Keep up. Keep it up after you've grown. And there won't be anything you can't do. That's great. So Luke is now an overachiever. We've accomplished everything we wanted. Also, they have memories of having a grandchild. Obviously, they have Brandon. So Luke... You're an overachiever, sweetie. Oh, look at that. He's just going and reading. Oh, no. He He's just lounging in the front yard. Just, hell yeah. We got their beach. All ready for him to age up in the next part. So I'm going to leave. This part has been quite long. Um, I'm just going to be a bitch to edit. Oh, I thought I'd just pause that. Okay. So in the next part, Luke will be aging up to an adult uh, and he'll be moving out to his own house, which I am yet to build. Um, and I probably will move in Orlando with him as well. And then I'll age up like the other teens in the neighborhood to adults so that all his friends are adults too. So he's not just lonely and friends with a bunch of teenagers <laughs> anyway though if you haven't already make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed also share with your friends this series if they enjoy the sims because i'm loving it you're loving it we're all loving it uh the first part of this series is almost on 200 views as well which is crazy um which is huge motivation to continue this and i'm gonna continue it i love it i'm enjoying it so much um and, like, the vast majority of people who are enjoying it are slowly growing as well. Uh, anyway, though, I will see you in... Oh, also, in the next part, we'll be playing with Tishan, Scott, and Brandon. And I believe Brandon, I'm going to be aging him up to a toddler. Because there really isn't much babies do in The Sims 2. <laughs> like, there, there are more things babies do, but in later expansions. So... We'll be aging him up to a toddler and we'll be experiencing the toddler lifestyle. So I would like to thank you guys for what I'd like to thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.